What's up, everybody? I'm Puma Pete. And I am Moose. And again, we are Friendly Fire Co-op playing Torchlight 2, playing Fishing Simulator 2098, where Mason, where we watch Mason try to catch fish. And I am very and successful at this circle. game. I know, it's super exciting. Almost as exciting as us trying to fight monsters. And with that in mind, we're going to go ahead and we're going to continue fighting monsters. Mason, try to keep up. Let's go. Hey, hey, I have one more fish to fish. Uh, well, you know what? We got stuff to do, and I need your help now. Alright, I'm on my way. Gotta fight all these bugs. So many bugs. And an armadillo. Armadillo. Aha. A zing. Remember that joke? That's <laughs> like a blast from the past now. <laughs> that happened all of, uh, four days ago when we recorded last. My four days ago, of course, mean, uh... Literally, like four literally minutes. 15 seconds. All, ago. All, all we did, we went back to base, we sold all of our stuff, and uh, we leveled up. So, I have all my skill points spent now, which is awesome. I had four points, and I had exactly four things to level up. So, I got some more points in that fire shooting ability. Got another point in my ability to teleport. Uh, Derek got stronger, which is great, of course, because he's the second best person in this Let's Play. Uh, behind me, of course, yeah. and in oh. front of Mason. <laughs> I made the joke before I could. Uh, yeah, yeah. Beat, beat you to it. How's it feel? Uh, well, feels bad, man. <laughs> and I also got a point into my one ability, which, as I hit people, it actually teleports them away from me. Super helpful to have, because if anything gets close to me, I'm basically dead. It's, uh, fiery axes, go away! Go away! Go away! Oh my, no, so many people with fiery axes, I don't understand why. why how do bugs even have the ability to do that? They went to the school. You know? The school for fire axe spinning. Something like that. We should get one of those in real life. I would love to learn how to spin fire axes. I'm sure that is a million times more useful than learning business, which is what I'm learning right now. Uh do you see that big spooky uh, armadillo? The giant there? armadillo? I think at this point I'm actually saying armadillo, but not on purpose even anymore. It's just happening. Like, I'm just hardwired to make that terrible pun. Ow! That hurt. You should try and die less. It's great advice. I feel like I'm reading comments. If we had comments, that's what they would say. Something along the lines of, you should try to die less. Our viewers out there, uh, Derek... Um, who are our viewers? What do we name them? Derek, Jose, Montague, Capulet, Third Esquire... And... and start with a J? No, we already said... S. Steve. Uh, Derek and Steve, e. if you're out there and you, con and you comment, you should die less. You know what? While I appreciate the advice, I, I feel, don't appreciate the advice. I feel that better things could be said. I appreciate that you're trying to help, but uh, literally anything else you say would be more useful than those exact words. Maybe die slower. Might have Look, helped. I don't come to you and say that you should comment faster. Uh, by the way, like, comment, subscribe, favorite, uh, retweet, add on Facebook, Twitter, Campbellgram, uh, Campbellgram. Um, uh, now Vine, you're just making them up. Uh, MySpace, MyFace, FaceSpace. Um, the real space, as in, like, the one above the, us. What does that even mean? Um, uh, take a picture of us in the space on a rocket. Oh, that space, yeah. I uh, do that. that follow us there. Uh, name a star after us. Um, that would actually be awesome. We should look into that. Uh, the Friendly Fire Co-op star. It's just a star of sadness and regret and failed opportunities. Yeah. <laughs> Why are there so many things? There's Holy just so God. many things everywhere. Because you, because you just, you kite, and you kite into stuff that we haven't killed yet. Man. 
there's an item on the ground, I swear, is a uh, plate spaghetti hoe. <laughs> but... Is that like a plate helm made out of spaghetti or a, a plate, like an actual plate that wearing to your head that's for spaghetti? I'm gonna go with the latter. To say that uh, it's a plate for your head that holds spaghetti. Speaking of plates, I was at, I was at a party recently. Uh, we were leaving the party and my friend just took a plate from the person's house. Just, he was like, I'm just taking this. And you didn't stop him? I, you know, I tried. He was very set on the plan of taking this plate. Uh, so if you had a party recently and you're missing a plate, sorry. It may have been my friend, it may not have been. I mean, odds are it's not. We probably don't, we probably haven't met in real life. But if it was, I'm sorry. And just know that I did my best to try to convince him and otherwise. And by best, he said no, and then the guy took it anyway. Yeah, that's a solid effort. On the plus side, we found a wallet that same night, and we returned the wallet. Because overall, we're good people. It had like 200-something dollars in it. Which you shouldn't do. You shouldn't just carry around $200. Uh, but if you are, you shouldn't lose your wallet. If you do lose your wallet, hope that nice guys like us return it. We're good people. We mean well. Every once in a while, a plate just, I guess, has to get taken. I don't even know. Let's hope it wasn't like a good china plate or something. It was not that. It was an average best plate. It was like I thought you were going to say a styrofoam plate. And I was like, you're playing this story up real bad, Peter. <laughs> I don't, can, is that even stealing at that point? Like, if it's a styrofoam plate... I have plenty of plates, you can just have one. If if someone stole one of your styrofoam plates recently and you suspect that it was my friend, I guarantee you it wasn't. But if you're really concerned about it, you could just have a styrofoam plate. Contact me at uh, one 800 styrofoam plates or us. Uh, we'll get you a plate. And or, again, that plate is on him, not me. <laughs> no, nah, uh, Mason was the friend that stole all those plates. He's a kleptomaniac. Uh, definitely. So, it's actually his responsibility. Oh god, okay, I... Alright, uh, the hooks are real. The hooks are real, Mason. I believe you now. Yeah, they do about a Look, billion damage, man. For anyone out there that actually watched our last episode, first of all, thank you. I appreciate it. Second uh, of all, thank you again. Third of all, we're not going to thank you a third time. Don't get a big head. Come on now. Let's be reasonable. Um, but more importantly, Mason told me there were guys that had, like, scorpion hooks that were like, get over here. I didn't believe them. And uh, as you may have just seen, I got hooked. So I officially believe Oh, I got hooked again. Don't die. Uh, so Mason wasn't lying all along. At least about that. At least about that. Probably about everything else. That whole plate story, that may have been a lie, you don't know. Maybe I don't maybe I don't even have a friend that would take a plate. No friends at all. No friends at all, actually. Zero. Not even Mason. We're not friends. We hate each other. That's why it's a friendly fire co-op. Because he just kills me. Oh, this armadillo. Why? Catch on fire. Teleport down here. Just casual. And nope. All right. I can't teleport down cliffs. That's stupid. A guy out there that made synergies mod. Um. I should be able to teleport down cliffs. Get on that. I love your mod. You did a great job. Uh, no offense. In no uh, offense intended. Um. I should be able to teleport down cliffs. Come on. Let's be reasonable. I don't even think that's you know not even that absurd of a request really. <laughs> How come when I go outside, I don't see all the wildlife like this? Uh, because you don't live in a forest like this one. Ah, okay. Yeah, you live in one of those deserts with all those trees and stuff. Uh, oh, I teleported down that cliff. All right, synergy's god, <laughs> synergy's mod guy. 
clearly heard my request mid recording and was like, I, I need to get on this. Puma Pete, he needs his ability to teleport down cliffs. And uh, thank you. Because of, you know, all them subscribers. That and, yeah, he implemented that extremely fast. Literally, like, you know, a minute, maybe max. Uh, so, thank you for getting on that so fast. I appreciate it. It means a lot to me. See if I can do it again. Bip! Oh, look at that. And let's get some more health and kite away from fire axe bugs again. Uh, no, no, go away, please. Uh, how much of the map do we have left to explore? Oh god, please no, why is that back? Oh, my bad, wrong point. You make me sad. No! Uh, teleport out of it. Yes. Ha ha. Suck it. Oh my god. I just took so much damage. I hate you so much. Ha ha. I dodged it. I hate you so much. Oh, I teleported into it. Are you kidding me? Ugh. I die because of that. I hate you so much. Nope. Ha ha! I dodged it again. That's the, uh, the bone... bone cage. Is that what it's called? Uh, yeah. That's the bone cage, uh, that I had discussed in a previous episode that I thought we got rid of. Apparently not. Apparently it's still here, which is awesome. I love being, you know, trapped in melee range with tons of enemies that will one-shot me. Like this. Oh, no, please. Aha. Told you it doesn't work anymore. I'm too smart for this now. Ha 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 ha. not going to work. As if we needed anything to hinder our progress anymore. See, it's pretty helpful here. Look at all these bugs. Yeah, but all you were doing was trying to aim it at me. I saw that. That's exactly where I was standing whenever you... Don't but act I like it was for the bugs. bugs. Don't act like it was for the bugs. Ah! That one was for you. I'm aware. All of them are for me. Are you even attacking enemies anymore, or are you exclusively bone caging things? Uh, I am attacking enemies. Uh, entered the Ember Craft. That may have been the first actually possible useful bone cage I've seen, and it wasn't anywhere near me. So perhaps it's not quite as cruelly of an ability as I initially suspected. I missed all those bugs though. Well, I certainly don't expect you to actually successfully trap enemies. It's more just about not trapping me. Haha! -ha! I there, saw I that. The I saw it. No, there, bull crap! You got the armadillo. Uh, well, it's still in there. Yes, it's in there, but that was not the intention there. Don't even act like it was. Uh, some people's kids. Some people's kids. It might be one of my favorite sayings in the world. No, I forgot to start the timer. Alright, we're just going to have to feel when it's right. Believe in the heart of cards, Peter. Believe in the heart of the cards. Approximately the right amount of time to stop. Alright, so for our three viewers out there uh, that was really hoping for an episode that would last exactly 25 minutes, I'm sorry. I'm... I, that's all I can say. I'm so, we're sorry. It's like that episode of uh, South Park with Cthulhu and BP. Don't worry, I trapped Derek. I'm being helpful. Yeah, he doesn't. I mean, he doesn't need to get in melee range of the enemies or anything. Like, he's perfectly useful just, you know, being in a cage. You can actually hit out of the cage. Yeah, it's because he's awesome. That's why he's a better teammate than you are. Uh, 
Oh, so many bugs. Just all of the bugs. Found a guy named the Eye King. I wonder why he's named the Eye King. I King uh, was also Steve Jobs' nickname. A lot of people don't know that. Only it was, you know, I, like the letter. Some intense fighting right here. Yeah, you're really uh, just not not helping me at all here on the conversation side of things. So, thanks yeah, for that. Yeah. Um... Sorry. Whenever you want to talk, that'd be that'd be great. There are two people on this YouTube channel, uh, believe it or not. Um, uh, no. What do you mean no? There's only one. There's only one? It's just me? I just do two voices. No, it's just Derek. <laughs> Spoiler alert, guys. There's only one of us. Uh, I am actually... I just do a Mason interpretation for the the second voice so I don't seem quite as sad and lonely. Oh hey guys, I'm Mason. Is that is that you doing the first day? Is that what you think you sound like? Or is that what you think I would it's sound exactly like if I was doing what I you? Sound like, man. All right, I got a skill point. Um, I think I can put it into Nether bolts. Yay. I'm um, what? Uh, yeah, I got a skill point as well, and I can put it into bone needles. It's like we have the same skill. All right, people, don't judge me. I know you just saw, again, my stats. Uh, I'm sure that they're all wrong, every one of them. I shouldn't be leveling focus. I should be leveling dexterity and luck and crit chance and... Uh, dodge, dip, dodge, dive, dodge, dodge, dip, duck, dive, and dodge. Uh, should probably be putting points into... Uh, strength and willpower and uh, I left a bunch of enemies over here by the way magic resistance and yeah I'm exploring just perhaps I should put points into exploring the map better I don't even know what that means that's not what's important uh, skeleton bone golem the monkey bandit things, I think, maybe. You know that when they're in that cage, we can't hit them. You're aware yeah, of that, right? Yeah, we can. Right? Nah, we, my attacks don't go shoot. through that. Oh, just kidding. Yeah, All they right. do. Alright, they do. You win. <laughs> You're drunk, go home. You're drunk, go home. I am home. And I'm sober. Well, I'm in a land cafe. Yeah. <laughs> Casual uh, YouTube channel from the land cafe. Yeah. I'm sure my, uh, everyone around you loves that. My, my neighbors do not like me right now. Your neighbors at your house or your neighbors at the land party? My neighbors at the land cafe. The land cafe, right, cafe, not party. Uh, what land cafe are you at? In case people um, want to come hang out while we do this. Quesa del Land. Quesa del Land? Uh-huh. The house of land? Yeah, of course. What uh, else would it be? And uh, where would that be located? Right next to the Pizza Hut. Uh, which Pizza Hut? Oh, um. <laughs> well, you see, it's down the hill from my house. Yeah, down the hill from your house. Where'd your house be? Ah, uh, I can't give that one away. Uh, look, if you guys want to send angry mail to Mason, uh, it's, um,. One Pennsylvania Drive, Washington D.C., um, District of Columbia, one six nine one four. That's my best guess at the president's uh, address. I don't really know. Does that sound about right? No. <laughs> no. What? Not at all. I'm sure I got the city right. A number there. One of those numbers has to be right somewhere in the address, I'm sure of it. Odds are, one of them is correct. Oh, come on now with that. I missed the enemies. 
Oh, really? You missed the enemies? How convenient. You just, you know, just casually miss oh, the enemies. Oh, jeez. Oh, oh, God. I need an adult. Derek, where are you? I got him! <laughs> How happy are you right now that that actually was useful? Well, I have a grin from ear to ear. Yeah. And... It's my crowning achievement in life. Caged a guy. Guys, it's really... It's not really a sign that, like, that, that cage was that awesome. It was just... Thanks. Uh, it's just that Mason has a really sad life. That's what it comes down Something to. Something like that. So uh, it's actually a, can't a, get my loot. It's a, a life filled with um, Cheetos and Surge soda. Do they even make that anymore? No, but how awesome was it when they had it? That was so good. It was pretty good. It was just like green goop. It was literally a color that drinks shouldn't even be able to be. Like Mountain Dew? No, it was definitely way more green than Mountain Dew is. It was like a neon green. It was like slime from Nickelodeon. Only more of like a soda you Fun can fact, see. Fun that fact, is, that is applesauce. It's applesauce? Yeah. I thought it was uh, water with green food dye. Applesauce. Really? Mm -hmm. Can we... Uh, Watched an interview with somebody and they said that it was applesauce. Alright, um, one of our three viewers get on that. Send us a link at, uh, uh, we love the 90s. Dreamcast.net. We love dreamcast.net. Um, at gmail.com. At, actually, you know what? At hotmail.com. I thought it was Yahoo. No one uses Yahoo. Let's be reasonable. Not even the made-up people use it. <laughs> not, not even the made-up fans that we have created solely for the purpose of this YouTube channel. They don't even use it. Oh, I just took so much damage from walking up that hill. That was a terrible mistake. Uh, Maybe you should uh, strengthen your walking muscles then up that hill. Oh. Boo. Boo to yourself, I'm not helping you anymore. You're not helping no, wait, me anyway. When did I start? Exactly, you can't even make that threat. I'm fighting a hero right now. I'm fighting everything else. There's just so many enemies on my screen right now. It's a mess. Well, that's where you went. Uh, thanks for uh, showing up, by the way. I'm really glad that you stopped fishing long enough to help me fight anything. Hey, I already fished all the fishing holes. Is that what they call it these days? Fishing the fishing holes? If you know what I'm saying? Uh, yeah, I get, I get yeah. what you're putting down. Uh, that's actually code for um, visiting his grandma in Swissvale. That's a place. Yeah, isn't it in Virginia? I don't know. Is it? Look, I don't know. One of our three fans, um, Derek, we're relying on you to find this out for us. Is Swissville in Virginia? Uh, like, comment, and subscribe if it's in Virginia. And if it's not in Virginia, also like, comment, and subscribe. And follow us on uh, MySpace at um, George Clooney's MySpace. Dot com. Dot com. I dot hope that's a website. Dot are you? For all of our, all those Russian George Clooney fans. Is that a yes or a no? Just not going to respond. <laughs> well, it is a yes and a no. What does that even maybe. mean? Maybe. It could be dot de. What is that even for? Denver? Germany. D -E I think Germany. Deutschland. For all those D's in Germany. You know that silent D at the beginning. <laughs> yeah. Like the Germany. It was actually Germany for a long time. 
<laughs> it was actually Dermony. When did the change? Uh, is this for World thing? War One? For World War One. All right, that explains a lot. That's why in, in history class it was still it's still Germany. It's a little known historical fact to take with you guys that Germany actually wants Germany, like dermatologist. Germany is actually where dermatology started. They just they invented skin there. Is that it now? Yeah. We were before that we were just walking clouds of bone and muscle. It was it's a rough world that you know the eighteen seventies. That's why they didn't have photography back then, because I mean no one wanted to see that. Nobody wanted to see the spooky scary uh, skeleton like things. Exactly. There's so much gold over here. Uh, so you know it's uh, pretty amazing right now is our death counter for this episode's at zero. Uh, we're gonna have to change that soon. Are we? Yeah. What is uh? What does that imply? Um, stuff. Fucking teleport away. Ah. Uh. Uh... This is why we can't be friends, Mason. Um. Is that is that right now? Yeah. Oh my God! I keep thinking your zombies are enemies. Ooh, spooky. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! I'm stuck, and I don't have enough mana to teleport. So here's here's the issue: the ability that allows me to generate mana is also costs mana. And I just, um, oh my god, I aggroed literally all of the things. <laughs> Sad days. Alright, pop up little imaginary death counter. Bloop, bloop, one. If we had a death counter, that's the sound effect that would be associated with it. If you didn't know. You know, this bone wall here helps a lot. Oh, really? Uh, it didn't help me, that's weird. It's because you're using it wrong, man. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I was probably trapped inside of it. Is that was that the part that was wrong? Yeah, man. That's weird. You got to uh, be outside of yeah, it. Yeah, you, maybe you should work on that. Work on what? I'm always outside of it. Yeah, so. like keeping me outside of it also. Nah. So much gold on the ground over here. Oh, I just died. Aha! Maybe you should have been outside that bone cage. Maybe I was outside that bone cage. Uh, obviously not. And apparently that's just the secret to not dying, is just being outside the bone cage. There's just like remnants of your bone cages everywhere. Either that or these are unrelated bone pillars. Oh no, please don't kill me, Mr. Scorpion Grab. The mythical scorpion grab that I guess is actually completely real. All right, uh, we are going to head back up that hill. Uh, next time on Friendly Fire Co-op, see you up. Bye.